This is the satellite Planck, which is turning around, more or less uh, making one turn every minute. As it turns, the, the telescope is sweeping uh, a ring uh, around the sky. And as the satellite itself goes around its orbit, around the sun, this ring is sweeping uh, different parts of the, of the sky. And after a certain amount of time, the whole sky has been covered. And this is the way that Planck uh, essentially makes a picture, a map of the whole sky. Basically, the only thing that we have which is a remnant of the Big Bang. So it takes us right back to the beginning of our universe. So the birth, the formation, the famous Big Bang, and the cosmic microwave background is the light that tells us about how that happened. Well, on this picture of the cosmic microwave background is basically the reddish stuff that you see behind the galaxy. Although the galaxy is beautiful, Unfortunately, it hides part of the cosmic microwave background from us, and you can see that very clearly here. You can only see the cosmic microwave background in small parts of the sky. But those bumps that you see, those grains between yellow and orange and red, that is in fact the signal that comes to us from the Big Bang. It is in fact uh, a first in many respects. Uh, of course, it is the first all-sky image that we are showing uh, from the Planck satellite, but also it is the first image that combines a wide range of phenomena uh, at the same time. In particular, we see uh, in this picture uh, things that belong to the very distant past, that is the cosmic microwave background, that is what we really want to, s want to see, in addition to the galaxy, which I was talking about before, which is also a big part of this, of this image.